We're rolling out. Wait, it's Miller time. It's Miller time. Miller, send me money. I'm on a sponsorship from Miller. Rolling out. Uh, welcome to Homeboy Cooking. Homeboy Cooking. It's basically a cooking show when uh, it's, that's two epic meals I need. Welcome to Homeboy Cooking. Today we're cooking up a classic, classic meal. It's not even a meal. It's more of a, it's more of an entree or a piece of a meal. You know, like fries or I don't know dip. Today we're making grilled chicken. Grilled chicken. That you don't have to. All you do is grilled chicken. False. How do you make grilled chicken? You ask. Well, grilled chicken consists of a chicken. This is how you make grilled chicken. First, raise a chicken. A chicken is an evolutionary descendant of dinosaurs. So once you raise the dinosaur descendant, fucking kill it. Once it's dead, chop off its tits. You're gonna peel the skin off and the feathers, throw it all away, or give it to you know McDonald's and make some nuggets out of it. You're gonna take the booby or the, the the chicken tit, whatever you want to call it, the breast, as most um, culinary experts use, breast, chicken breast. It means chicken tit. And you're gonna put a little little seasoning on it, you know, like that dumb shit on Instagram. Then you're gonna grill it or grill it, as people that aren't fucking retarded say. Uh, well, you know what? Let's skip into it first. Step one: get some chicken tits. Pop the molly. I'm sweating. Ooh, I'd go for some ecstasy. I could, no, that'd be fun. I got a ton of them. Um, you know, f a good question actually. What are the chances, like both boobs belong to one chicken? I'm pretty sure they're all different boobs of different chickens. What are the chances the chickens knew each other? Vegans, you're gonna love this question. Full disclosure, vegans, I agree with you. Eating animals is wrong. But I feel so disconnected from the actual killing, I'm okay with it. I look at it this way. Imagine you're a slave owner in like 1829. You know, I realize slavery's bad, but let Get a cutting board or two. This one is made of um, the stuff Batman gets shot with. And this one my mom got me for Christmas. You can use it and then you can fold it up to get all your chicken tits into the thing. Okay, let's do this. All right. It's Miller time. It's actually like 12.30. So you're gonna use a knife to open up the bread. That's a bread knife. Gonna use a knife to open up the breasts. Just imagine like you roofied a woman and you're trying to get at her actual br All right, there we go. Boom, delicious. So we're gonna go, we're gonna go Ali you. This is going back in here because I actually, you know what? I'm gonna get baggy. Perfect. Come on, come on out air. My triceps looking great. Wash your hands, you don't want to get malaria. Good news, we didn't need all this. Boom, does that look delicious or what? Amazing. Step one, pepper. Damn, am I John Favreau or what? I think I've watched a little too much Chef. Do 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 do. My name's Chef. I can't use that joke because that's fucking copyrighted by the cool people of YouTube. Here's a secret. I use a little Tom Douglas special sauce. It has a lot of sugar in it and it makes it unhealthy. That's the secret. Get your cleanest pan you can find. This one's brand new. And cook your chicken tit. Add the juice of an olive. Bam, John Favreau style. So basically what you got here is you got a dead chicken, cut its tit off, you put a little bit of pepper, which comes from a grass root that you take the peppercorns and grind it up, then you drill into the ground, get a little salt crystal, grind that up, sprinkle it upon the dead chicken tit, then get some olives, grow them, juice them, get the olive oil, put it in the pan, heat it up, and grill it, and you got an all natural Grilled chicken. It's Miller time. Flip it when you feel like it. It's Miller time. It's Miller time. Miller time. Miller time. I can smell the flavor from here. Looking tasty. Plate it like a king. Put your pan 
in the dishwasher. Witchcraft! These things remind me of an abortion. Boner apple tits. Oh, oh god. That's severely underdone. You know, on the on the plus side, it's melody.